so many things that cause us stress and lowers our vibration is because we don't value and respect ourselves enough. We value and respect other people, other things that are not serving us more than ourselves. Because if we loved ourselves, had that self-worth, the self-love, if we nourish that within us, we wouldn't want to eat shit food. We wouldn't want to be around shit people. We wouldn't want to have shit behavior. And that's the thing, you might think you want this. There's so many things in my life that I thought I wanted. And then I realized I never wanted it. It was the ego. It was the old me, the, the lower vibration me that thought I wanted certain things. And then you get it and you realize I didn't want it because they're not serving me. If anything, they're holding me back. I don't want any of this. And through respecting and valuing and loving yourself, having these habits and doing them over and over and being resilient with them. A perfect example is I've been dancing for 10 years. This year was the first year I had the confidence enough to go street performing, making over $100 a night, doing what I love to do, spreading good vibes. The amount of love I get from strangers because they see me putting myself out there and spreading love and confidence and holding a space. Wow, this dude's dancing. I'm going to go dance with this guy. Let's do it. And they may not even have that confidence in the club or without taking a couple shots of liquor. But here I am out there doing it, holding a space for them to feel safe and confident enough to let loose as well. But it took me 10 years to get there, 10 years of dancing. That's what I'm saying, through these habits, through repetition, you can build up that confidence. Through valuing yourself and choosing yourself, your self-worth, your self-love over these other things, you will build up that inner confidence, that true confidence, not confidence that comes from outside influences, comes from other people valuing yourself, but the confidence that comes from within comes from you. And that's true, unshakable confidence where outside things, outside influences, outside elements cannot deteriorate, cannot shake this up. This is everlasting confidence. And through repetition of doing these things and valuing yourself, you can build up that confidence. Like I said, it took me 10 years. And now I even have a job. I get paid dancing for my city. To do what I love. They place me at events and I get paid. And I know this is only the beginning. Dance is going to take me so far. I, I want to battle. I want to touch these stages. I watch some of my idols and some of these people I look up to, whether it's a Red Bull, whether it's a summer dance forever, whether it's just a butte, whether it's whatever it might be. I want to touch these stages, but not just touch. I want to win prizes and awards. And I know I can because I've built up that confidence, that resilience, and I know the work behind the scenes that no one sees. They didn't see the 10 years it took me to, to get to that street corner to put myself out there. They didn't see that. They just see me out there now. And no one ever does see the work. But that's the thing. You got to put in the work. And through that, you will erect and nourish this confidence within you that's unshakable, that's unmovable, unbreakable.